In this video, I'm going to show you how to install mods for Minecraft 1.21.6. So the first thing you're going to want to do is come over to this website right here. I will leave a link in the description down below. From here, what we're going to want to do is actually click on the download button, select that. And then from here, select download for Windows. Now what we're going to want to do is also get the Fabric API as well, as we do need this as well, so select this. And from here, what we're going to want to do is actually scroll down, come to files. And inside of here, what we're going to want to do is actually find the newest version for Minecraft then click on the three little dots and select download. Now we'll let that download. We're also going to need some mods as well. So I will leave a link in the description down below to this website. From here, we can download any mods that we want. Also, I will leave a link as well to this website where you can download mods from this website as well. But now what we're going to want to do is actually look for a mod that we want to use in Minecraft. Now we do need to look for a fabric mod as we are installing fabric. So what we're going to want to do is actually come down here to the fabric, select that. And make sure you've got the newest version of Minecraft selected as well. Then once you've done that, you can simply scroll through here and have a look for some mods that you'd like to install. Now for me, I'm going to do this mini map mod, so I'm going to select on here. And from here, what we're going to want to do is actually come up here to versions. And inside of here, we want to find the newest version of Minecraft and then select download. Also do make sure that it does have the fabric there. Very important, you do need that. And we're going to select on download here. Now while that is downloading, if you want to get yourself a Minecraft server, be sure to check out GCHETS Gaming. They have some really good high quality servers. Also it does come with a DDoS protection, so be sure to check them out at the link in the description down below. Now we are on the desktop, from here what we're going to want to do is come down to our Fire Explorer and then find our Downloads folder. Select that and inside of here you can see that we have got our new mods. So simply what we're going to want to do is just drag all these out onto the desktop, like that. Click on the little X button and from here what we're going to want to do is actually install the Fabric Loader or the Fabric Installer. So make sure you just double click on this file. And this will load up a little menu on the screen and from here what we're going to want to do is actually select on the install button and once you select that it has now installed then click on ok from here select the little x button and what we can do is we can actually get rid of this file now we don't need that one no more now for these two files here we need to install these into our minecraft directory but before we do that if you do not have the little coffee mugs in here you need to install java i will leave a link in the description down below on how to install that that is very important and make sure that is installed. So what we're going to want to do from here is actually load up a Minecraft launcher. Inside of our Minecraft launcher, automatically you should see that we have the fabric loader down here for the newest version of Minecraft. If it's not here, select the little arrow here and we should be able to select it from in here. If it's still not in here, come to installations and inside of here, make sure modded up here is selected. That is very important. Now once we are in this page, what we're going to want to do is actually select this little button just here. We just select this button just here. And this will load up our Minecraft directory. Inside of here, we actually want to look for our mods folder. Now, if you don't have a mods folder, what you can do is you can actually just right click on the side here. You can hover over new, then come to folder, select that. And inside of here, just simply just type in mods like that and click on enter. And once you've done that, just double click into this file. And inside of here, what we're going to want to do is actually just drag in these two files. Simply like that, then click on the little X button. Back on your Minecraft launcher, come to play and then select on play. Now sometimes you might get a warning on the screen like this. If you do, select I understand and then click on play. And now once you come into Minecraft, as you can see in my top corner, you can see I've actually got a mini map. So this is how you install mods for Fabric for the newest version for Minecraft. 